welcome to my youtube channel i will talk about very dangerous and life-threatening disease that it is malaria disease a malaria disease is a life-threatening disease that causing acute febrile illness and there is a parasite that is called plasmodium plasiperm uh, p vivix p ovale p malaria and p nolacy this one is caused by because of the infected mosquitoes this mosquito is called anaphylis mosquitoes this disease can be preventable and curable if early recognized and early treated so how malaria be transmitted there is a cycle for transmission of this disease that is beginning from the infected mosquitoes that it is anopheles uh, mosquitoes that it is uh, going to the human being and infected him cause the problem in all body organs especially liver that it is producing the blood uh, red blood cells that it is being infected and this uh, disease can be transmitted to another person with the uh, contact or with the blood transfusion or there is from the mother to her fetus during delivery or after delivery so the most problem is from the mosquitoes so there is a sign and symptoms here it is fever dry cough headache and nausea and there is we will see most the sign and symptoms that will cause for the adult and for the children also so there is a risk for infection how we will get the infection this disease depend on many factors first the mosquitoes that we will we talk about the type of mosquitoes called anaphylis mosquitoes that it is transmitting the infection there is some countries mostly the tropical countries they are having more mosquitoes or there is uh, more uh, waters so this can cause the malaria disease also the seasons if it is rainy and winter season the uh, the disease may occur most lastly the presence of swamps and water pools that mosquitoes lived around it so this is most of the factors and uh, that cause the transmission of the disease or occurring of the disease in the country so what is the sign and symptoms of malaria there is difference between malaria in adults or in children so in adults there is headache fatigue nausea vomiting chills fever and muscle ache and lastly may can cause confusion coma and lastly death and for children most there is the sign and symptoms of malaria same as adult but there is extra they will have anemia a respiratory problem cardiac problem or even uh, cerebral malaria so this is mostly the sign and symptoms of children and adults so how we will prevent the malaria disease there is many ways you can prevent the malaria disease first we can prevent mosquitoes by by protecting the environment with a mosquito spray that must be safe and effective also we can use type of cream to prevent mosquitoes bite this is actually must be with the doctor's uh, advice also the clothes must be covering the arm and leg and there is a special spray also to spray your clothes and the mosquitoes will be uh, away from you also there is a net for the babies we can use it for preventing mosquitoes bites and in the home keep mosquitoes out of the room by lodging the air conditioning doors and windows with the screen or net so we will prevent the mosquitoes to enter to your home to 
prevent the mosquito bite and getting the infection. But if you get mosquito bite, don't itch the place and put some types of cream. And if, if you are suspecting the malaria disease, so you must go to the nearest hospital for management and treatment. Thank you very much. This is uh, you put like and subscribe to get a notification. And thank you very much. And for more information, please you can read my blog page that it is in the comments. Thank you very much.